question? Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Claire. Question? Bitch, come Why on. Why you keep that gonna hit me? I got the damn rabies. Keep your rabies on me. I see them all. Hitting me, thank hoes. They touching the queen. Oh Jesus, bad bitch. You not put what's your mama tell you about putting your hands on pretty bitches? Ugly people don't put their hands on pretty bitches. Put that shit up, bitch. <laughs> Messing up my hair, I'm moving. Bitch. Keep my shit. No. You don't play this man. Fuck me. I'm a chair, my motherfucker. I had your egg in the ass. Can you put that? Can you no, give me my shit? It's making me think no. I'm fidgety. You get back at the end of the video. Who the fuck is you? Your mother. You know, I had your egg. You egg-egg. want your lips? You want your mouth? You better Move put my head. shit down. <laughs> give me yeah. the road. Give me. No fucking rope. Shoes. 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 Damn, what two thousand six? I don't even. We don't do this somewhere. I don't know what my hair thing is. You know, Nate keep taking my shit. It's over here somewhere. Well, you give me my shit. Can you let go? I wouldn't have to use this. Let go. I gotta wash it and put it back in my shit. No, because it's 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 a new shoe. The ones I got from um. Anyway. (laughs) <laughs> oh my god, come on. So before we get into this video, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell notification button so you know when I post when we post another video. The beginning of the episode we seen Biggie and Stunner fighting. Who you think one between that one from? Well, with the security guards being all in the well. Can't really Biggie. tell I'm not fucking outside for this one. Fuck Stunner. I don't like that. I don't like Stunner Girl either, but I'm not picking a side for this one because... You not picking a side. You said who won that fight. It wasn't a fair fight. I thought... Because y'all didn't even really get to fight because the security guards is always in the fucking way. But Biggie did. Biggie did. Biggie did like she would throw her hands off. Okay. Period. I love Biggie. That's my girl. But, but girl, um, you got too much of this, cause bitch, put me your fucking now. baddies wet. Okay. I'm a mop that bitch like grass. So then, you ever watch somebody cut the grass? <laughs> bitch, I'ma snip your ass off. <laughs> oh, um, they were all in the kitchen talking. Tommy, Biggie, Natalie. What the fuck is that? Wait, you? <laughs> they didn't stop me trying to talk about the episode. That's what they here for. I know. So, Autumn, it was in the day going to kiss and talking, and, um, Stunner, but not Stunner, Biggie was just talking about what happened, so then that was like, why do I need to go talk to Biggie, because, not Biggie, Stunner, because a such and such seemed like she was getting into it with everybody and into what's going on. So, Natalie went to go talk to Stunner, and, and Stunner was just like, well, all these bitches want to meet me, I don't know, I don't got one common enemy, all this and that stuff. Girl, you can get your ass up by everybody. You just need your dad. Right, you a neat chicken ass. Huh? And, right. Because me, I just see it as though, like, one, it's not just you looking for camera time. It's just like you just want to start with everybody because. Well, you want to make it like you feel like you the baddest bitch on camera, off camera. Because to me, it don't even look like you're really doing anything off camera. Because it's just as much time as you get off camera. Why you ain't doing the same shit? Exactly. So, it was the same in my, bitch, what is you doing? That's how it was me. And then, what happened next? Then we didn't gonna see how her and Natalie were just sitting there saying, well, um, all these girls just don't like me. And I was like, girl, if they didn't like you, I mean, if they did like you, bitch, you not trying to get along with everybody. You just want to fight everybody just seem like, like statement that you said, you didn't like constructive criticism when what Biggie said. 
So when Biggie said that shit, she was right. Because you know, you ready to fight somebody because you was like, you feel like everybody trying to be your mama. No. Somebody's trying to give you some advice or something. You want to they gonna get mad. Like, girl, sit your egg legs down. Yeah, you gonna skip the part when Natalie and all of them got on the private jet and Tommy and Rolly and them got on the Sprinter. So Tommy and Biggie and them went to Forever 21. Bitch, they Forever 21 look better than our shit down this way in North Carolina. Hey. They should look way better. Got more options. Oh, I hope the fuck so in Vegas. Okay. Sure. So everybody was on their way to um Arizona. So Biggie and all them um got some night clothes, whatever, some pajamas, and gave them to the other girls. And they went in CVS, bitch, trying to steal the shit, bitch, come out a challenge. See who can get the the most expensive thing in there. What? I'm sorry, I would have been with kid. I'm not stealing the <laughs> bitch. I went in there and then um. Them child days is over. Okay. I mean. Okay. I he mean, was. Tommy was trying to bring a little bit of fun, but not. I'm gonna do something fun instead of that's, trying to go that's to jail. That's still something with the law, bitch. That exactly. Ain't gonna fuck they want to jail with you, Tommy, know. bitch. You got too many mug shots. Too many. Girl, you got more than anybody to school. Like bitch. Natalie said, the camera follows. Okay. Uh, now. And what, uh, one of them said, we gonna be on this news tomorrow. The, the fuck? No, ma'am. They're gonna no, be looking for y'all, though. They're gonna be looking for y'all. I ain't got time. Why can't I say I pay for all my shit and all that stuff? Mm -hmm. Okay. No, ma'am. I can't be with you. Um, what's, what's the, uh, Miss Cat said? I'm too grown for that. I'm, I'm big in my, in my age, in my age for that. Tommy, you 38, you doing extra like that, girl? Sit down. You could have found something else to, to have fun with. I understand you want to bring fun because ain't nobody really been having fun except for going to the club. You want to do something fun outside the club. Y'all could have went and did something else. You could have, we could have went to the bowling alley. Uh, well, y'all was on the road, but I don't damn know. Y'all could have just did something else. Showed y'all titties outside or something. I don't fucking. <laughs> I don't know. This is not all I want to write it, baby. You don't want you to come here, baby. No, baby. I don't know. I was just guessing. Like, y'all could do something else. I was so confused. I can see you right now. Y'all, I think we should go out there and show our titties. This <laughs> you. No, man. Would it be? <laughs> Big B. double D. <laughs> Triple. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna work out in one week. It's getting stupid. That we gotta do this for me to be. So, um, after that, child, um, what's the damn that? Stunna, Natalie, Natalie, and raising them was talking to them private jet. Now. And Scotty, thank ass, was on the damn private jet talking and stuff. And Razor, you know, she be drinking. When she drinks, she's turned into a whole different other person. And, and I can't hang with fun. nobody that's going to fucking change your character. Because, bitch, did you pick up a bottle? Bitch, I'm sorry. Because me personally, if I'm around a motherfucker, you can sit here and drink. You going to sit here and drink in front of me. And you going to act a fucking ass. Okay. You go ahead and take the bottle with you and get the fuck out of my face. Because I'm, I'm really telling you. Because, bitch, let the liquor get in me and I'm ready to fight, bitch. Oh, but I'm saying shit. she's trying yeah. to a whole different person. But what I'm saying is, you need to, some people need to learn how to control their alcohol. I don't like stuff like that. Like, right. like when I get drunk, I know I get a little freak. I'll be ready to such and such. I'm ready to do something else. Okay. They be having me in a good mood. Okay. I'll be like, I don't be ready to fight and like some people be ready to fight okay. and stuff when they get drunk. That's not me. Like, and be ready to argue. Uh -oh. Why would I want to? Why would I want to be arguing about my head? My, I'm dead. To you. No him. No sir. No him. No sir. But you waste the time and energy and look a bitch. Okay. You're not no. gonna waste my time. No. So then, suddenly it's like, well, I'm not ready to get over Biggie. Why? And Ray's were just saying, me and Scotty got over our situation. Why can't you, Biggie, and Tommy get over y'all? Biggie not worried about you. Tommy not worried about you. Let me tell you right there. Yeah. I could still see why it's still a girl. I'm not checking up for some girl, but I'm just saying. I could see why she's still upset because, bitch, if I just got in a fight not too long ago, bitch, I'm going to still be upset about it because, bitch, I'm not going to be over it. I mean, but, but, I could be cool getting on the fucking jet and the plane and y'all getting up here that's what asking I'm me all these questions, bitch. I'm not going to. Now, personally, if I was still a girl, I would have just been like, look, I don't feel comfortable talking about this conversation right now because I'm still aggravated and pissed about the situation that happened earlier. So can we just let it go and have a good time? Now, yeah. if Razor would have kept antagonizing the whole situation, then I could see why Stunner Girl would have got aggravated. But she's so but. quick to jump to, because of criticism. Like, 
But well, I can see where you coming from. But what I'm coming from is like Scotty and Razor, they over it. They they not friends, but like she said, y'all can be in the same room. And but you gotta understand, I mean, they don't mean they people, like each other. Everybody not gonna be the same way. You gotta understand, some people yeah. not gonna let certain situations go. Just but like it don't even have to be that situation. It, it could be a whole a whole different situation, and they let it go easier. But we grown. We not in high school. We here to make money. We not here to become friends, to bitch. I'm still mad at a nigga from you know what three you, years ago, bitch. I'll be ready to beat his but ass. you know what you right. signed up for. You know we here to make money. We know you know we not here to make friends. You know we not here to just be arguing big right. and fighting out it will. So if you we go on the tail, you up, we, all of them over the age twenty five except Krishan and Krishan, the only one that should be at with the bitch. Krishan not even that bitch. You should be mature but after the age of eighteen. That's what I'm saying. Huh. Well, some people ain't. But you know how they say females be, become more mature than me. So bitch, it's time to go away. Oh yeah, and before we even get any further, dear Krishan. I understand. You don't have your little thing. You had your thing because of your dude or whatever. She still got her thing. But it's not even no point in you being on a show. You you won't even show up. But they said why they were feeling bad as well as they were filming um. For the blue face. For even love and last Yeah. Mm-hmm. But my whole thing is why well, even be on that as well. Cause she wants to be on season three. That's them. Uh, my man ain't for her. Again. I mean, and whatever float show boats to make you happy, should do what you do. But she might be been nothing, but we never know. That's just my opinion. I'm giving my opinion to everything I'm saying right now. Yeah. So, and then um, another girl thing, I'm jumping back to the Biggie, and I wanted to say this, because back to the Biggie and Stunner Girl situation, because bitch, if a bitch would start calling me names and all that, bitch, I'm going to let you slide, because all that talking shit is for the birds, bitch, and all that pulling hair whack ass shit is for the fucking birds. That's why... I, I don't really care for the hair and long hair. Oh, you talking about bigger? Okay. Both of them. Uh-huh. And then she threw your fucking chain. Because, bitch, if I work hard for something and you throw oh, my yeah, shit, because I work hard I'm going to stuff your fucking hand in the concrete, bitch. Don't even worry about it. Bitch, what's up? It's up in the stuff. You want to go, oh, you stinky ass, bitch. I know what I want. I know that my pussy good. I know that I wash my ass. But do you? You worried about what's going on over here. Whatever she said, more after, or after, whatever the hell she said, I'm gonna say what she said. At the end of the day, I don't think Stunner Girl gonna ever get over this shit. To me, the whole season, even when it come down to the uh, the reunion, I feel like you still gonna be fussing and fight. Like, you ain't gonna never get over that. You the type of person you don't want nobody to tell you what the fuck to do. You yeah. still, oh, if it's my mother, if it's my mother, sometimes you gotta listen. You don't have to. But, but they're trying to really tell Stunner to. is Stunner, we're older than you. We've been with your ex. We've grown. We not doing the stuff that you're doing now. So when you doing stuff like that, we know how to coexist with people we don't like. Right. And stuff and like I understand that. why that. When you in the workplace, when you in the workplace, you gonna be around people you don't like. Why? When I was working at one way, I was around people I didn't like. You know. Bitch, I had to work who I didn't Bitch, like. We had a, but what I'm saying is, you know, you got to make your money to pay your bills or whatever you got to do with your money. So sometimes I'm like, well, I work, but like at the end of the day, I'm not gonna act professional because of the position that I have. That's what I'm saying. So therefore, you gotta, bitch, you can't be acting a fucking fool like a fucking hoodlum. Rat, all of them bitch. dead cast, all of them my coworkers. Y'all gotta make a show. So if it was about my money, so bitch, if I just got a big check from Zeus, it was like, yeah, such and such and such. I'm not about to be that on um, big and argue with a bitch with something that's so stupid. When you think about it, it's so stupid. Like, like Biggie said, the situation was about because. They asked her a question about what Tommy, the Tommy situation with her and Tommy fought the first day. And she said that wasn't the time of the place. So, bitch, you got man. Oh, who the fuck with him? Make it make sense. But, anybody's child. So, then Razor and Stunner got into it. I guess Razor was trying to still talk to Stunner about the situation and... Stunner got mad and pulled off the bitch wig and it was up in the stuff. Razor was ready to whoop her ass. So. Yeah, because she seen if I was around Stunner, I know not to wear her hair around this bitch because I promise you, they're here pulling shit. Oh, you. I would have paid some money for my wig if I would have had 30 in- Even though I would never wear 30 inches, that's not for me. But if I was to wear 30 inches, something like that, bitch, and you put my good old wig off, 
I'm gonna tell you my old man told me he had to stop. He said, man, I'm too old to be fucking fighting. I'm gonna get okay. my fucking pissed out the car. Well, Logan said, I'm gonna pay money for my nails, my hair, my makeup, somebody. They want to mess my shit up. I'm gonna beat your ass. And you gonna pay for my shit to get that nigga. You should have picked somebody else besides some of her. She's the only one. Well, people think she's a fan. They want her to be a fan. They want. They think she's a fan favorite. So if y'all if y'all like her stuff like that, I can see why some of y'all like her because it's she's bringing opinion. the I don't drama. Know what about to say. I mean, I'm just saying what yeah. I gotta say because it's my opinion. Bitch, it's a part right. of the opinion for a fucking reason. But at the end of the day, if we still on a girl team, do what you do. But I like everybody else because everybody else kind of fucking problem. It's her, like, Mm-mm. I don't want to hang with a bitch that want to fight twenty four seven. And don't get me wrong, yeah. I used to hang with somebody that wanted to fight all the fucking time. That shit is lame as fuck. Like, be a lady, not a hood rat. Yeah. But um, y'all, that's really all that really happened this episode. Next episode, we are gonna see what more unfolds, something like that. But anyway, child, um, thank you guys for watching. Comment what you guys think below, child. Let me know what you guys think. It's your birthday. Sugar Aquarius. Share this video. Share with a friend. Let us know what you guys think in the comments. On the way to 4K. On the bed of speech. This is Thank Bitch. <laughs> and don't yeah, touch bitch. me. And y'all. Bye.